to those who compete against me, I, I, I usually just tell them, uh, you should just stop trying, you know, because you're never going to get there. You're never going to get to my level. Uh, you're never going to get close to my level. Anybody can have some, like, pretty sick athletic talent. I feel like you should be allowed to go out there, run around, do your best. I wouldn't say that I am someone who can be up there with the best of the best because I'm someone who hopes to eventually speak about the best of the best. This is a good opportunity for me to showcase my speed. You know, we might not have strength in uh, every area, but I do believe that this is a good chance for me to showcase some of my, uh, my better abilities. Defensive back day at the NFL Combine goes right up there with uh, day three of the NFL Draft for my two favorite days of the year. I expect to get relatively cocky about my bench because I don't think I'm going to lose that. When it actually comes time to compete and when he's in between the lines, he turns into a little bit psycho and I have that little bit of psycho in me. It's my life, you know, I watch it every day, uh, every waking second of every day. <laughs> so I call myself a football athlete, you know, just by osmosis. I do think that my agility and my speed are two of my strong suits. I think I'd describe myself as, as Dwayne Wade, you know, well, athletic, speedy, but not, not too flashy. Excelling is relative, right? Um, just because someone runs faster, another one, another person in the 40, that doesn't mean they're faster.
Anything less than the best is a felony. That's what Ben Eli said himself. I stand by those words. I am looking to place in the top one or two for definitely the Wonderlick. That's where I can compete.